back, everybody, to House of Ashes. Run away from some goddamn enemies. Something simple, this goddamn place? No, it's a cave filled with not serious. That looks ancient old. temple stuff. We have. Can you see him? Yeah, he's coming. He's gonna shoot you. What you got, Ashley Tazel? Oh! <laughs> she got moves. Get your head in the game. <laughs> Literally. Oh. I was scratching my leg. <laughs> my hand wasn't on the mouse. Easy does it. Easy does it. Why is everything collapsing? Oh, you're very calm about her falling to her death. I got you. I got you, Rach. Don't worry. What's that? Your head's falling off? You're fine. Relax. There you go. Grab that rock. Yeah. Good job, Rach. I got you. It's okay, Rach. I got you. Calm down, Ashley. You gotta stop struggling, babe! Just die already! <laughs> cut the rope, Eric! Just cut it! Be done with this! Rachel, grab onto something! I can't see! It's too dark! You have a light in your head? Come on! Fuck! Damn it, Rachel, will you hold still! <laughs> Stop swinging around already, dang it! Stop being a Spider-Man! I'm so sorry, Rachel. I'm so sorry. Oh, wait. <laughs> I was joking! <laughs> Wee! <laughs> wait, is she actually gonna die? Nah, I think she's fine. I bet you she's fine. It's just gonna come back later and he'll... <laughs> he'll be like, You dropped me! Our marriage is over! And he'll be like, It was already over, hot stuff. You've been cheating on me. Hey, we're back to Senor Comover. What nightmare have these luckless souls fallen into? I don't know. Poor Rachel has been lost to the darkness. Or has she? Bonds that were once thought unbreakable have now been cut free. The heart is always the first to fall. Depends on how you fall. What of Jason and Nick? Brothers in arms, but are they really as close as they appear? Or will it be a case of each man for himself? Let's not forget that they've already lost Corporal Merwin to the dark. Yeah, that was and the dope. Night is still young. Which brings us to Salim. He seems level-headed, an almost reluctant soldier, perhaps. An unwelcome fate now awaits our survivors. Good. Beneath the earth, swallowed by the void. Nice. One by one, their lights will be snuffed out. Unless you can find the means to save them. I will. Don't worry. It's not my place to concern myself with the affairs of others, but it does keep things... <laughs> to be a gossipy bitch. <laughs> I can offer you some words of advice, as long as you are willing to keep this strictly ourselves sure yes can he tell that i'm recording this a prudent choice all things considered long ago i met a blind poet who impressed upon me these wise words long is the way and hard and out of hell 
leads up to light. That's all for now. Cool. He sounded really awesome. And he, a child could have come up with that. 162 feet down with Jason and Nick. What's going to happen? I don't know. Are we going to set for fire? Are we going to set for die? I messed up, right? I'm so sorry. She's fine. This, everything. God. Wait, what if she's not? <laughs> I killed a man. I fucking killed Merwin. It was an accident. Just like the woman at the checkpoint. Don't make shit weirder than it already is. <laughs> Stop Stay saying things. <laughs> Stop admitting to crimes already. God damn it. Look, we're going to get out of here and be back at Outback Steakhouse hey, at 6 p.m. Is that you? I, I, what happened to Rachel? I might have killed your girlfriend. We, we were ambushed by the enemy. The open fire on us. <laughs> Rachel. She fell. I, I held on. I held on as, as hard as I could, I swear. She was taking me down with her. I had to. I had to cut the rope. Rachel! We gotta move. <laughs> Colonel, we're sitting ducks. We need to fall back now. Over there. Let's go. God, the... <laughs> Everything's just happening like cut, 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 cut. It's so look weird. Wow, look at that. So many places to get lost and die. Feet. Glorious giant feet. Slow down. We can still be here. Right now, Colonel, the Iraqis are the least of our problems. We're dealing with some winged hell uh -oh. spawn. Mailman to one actual to all call signs. How copy over? Joey, report in over. Joey's dead. The fuck you talking about? The Iraqis tore right through him. He died in my fucking arms. Oh yeah, he died in your arms. I was like, wait, didn't he die? Didn't oh, you see no, him die? Joey. The hell are we gonna get out of this? <laughs> We gotta lock this place down. Form a defense perimeter and buy ourselves some goddamn breathing space. Lieutenant, what did you mean when you said the Iraqis are the least of our worries? You believe in God? Absolutely not. I didn't even get to pick. We'll start believing. We are under attack by. I don't know what. And you wouldn't believe me even if I tried. Hell, I don't believe in those there. Monsters. Monsters? Come on, you're jumping at shadows. Sir, with all due respect. Lieutenant, we're trapped down here with an enemy Iraqi, maybe more. Whatever you think you've seen, it's bullshit. These statues. Nick, take a mental picture and snap the fuck out of me. <laughs> yeah, Nick, <laughs> idiot. <laughs> it's not the silos, that's for sure. This mission's a bust. I can fix this. The satellite. Look over the data to improve the algorithm. They're clearly teething problems. Um, people have kind of died here, bro. I just want to go home and drink whiskey. Oh, fuck your satellite. Good men have died. Clarice is gone. Your wife is dead, Eric. You led us on a suicide mission. Hey, I'm still in command here. You'd better remember your rank, Lieutenant. I'll get us out of here. I got us into this mess. Into this mess. <laughs> That's literally what I was just out. saying. Do you want to repeat that? <laughs> oh. That's what I thought. I wrote this game. Uh oh, it's the demons. They come get you. Stay and guard the entrance. Go check it out. I don't know, Jason and Nick, brothers in arms, but are they as close as they think they are? I don't know. 
Got a light. Nick. You got my back, right? You got my back like a snail stuck in the side of a boulder, right, Nick? Come on. If we go through this door, we figure it out. Ain't nothing I can't shoot with my M16 rifle. Hey, we're back in this room. So this is Saddam's chemical weapon silo, huh? Run for the what? fucking hills. We're all doomed. Why did you come back up so the steps? For Eric's pioneering thermal satellite system. Eric's gonna have some pretty tough questions to answer. I wouldn't like to be in those shoes. <laughs> yeah, like, why did he kill his wife? <laughs> Man, these games always go from, like, not scary at all to just straight up goofy. But I kind of love it. There's the generator. Let's go take a look. Touch it. Need a hand here. I'm on it. You need a pair of pliers Someone's as well. Someone's thickness here is dislike to this thing. Sabotage. Looks it. Watch my back. Ah, shit. Was that the Iraqi man oh, or the... Around. Hurry up. The beast. Or maybe Let's it was Salim. Like I'm fucking around. Hell yeah, yeah look at my skills, Sergeant. Colonel. Lieutenant. Stay alert. Dropkick, this is Mailman 2-1 Actual. We're heading deeper. Over. Acknowledged. You be careful in there. Dropkick out. Damn, Dropkick is such People a cooler stay. name than Mailman. Let's see what they lead to. Jason, are you mad at him that he got dropkick and you're stuck with mailman? Uh, super amazing, awesome guy. This is uh, the milkman. Uh, we're heading deeper into the tunnel. Over. Hey, laser beam. This is a. Uh, this is a uh, pillow fluffer. <laughs> I was trying to think of more of them, but I'm just making myself giggle. <laughs> Uh-oh, watch out. It's a goddamn boober trap. Huh! Fuck. Watch your step. There's a tripwire. Oh, it kind of would have been awesome to not click that. I kind of want to see everyone die. I want to see how messed up you can make the game. Clear. It looks simple enough. Counter explosion? Nah. Just need to cut the trigger. Well, that's very easy. Gotta be the guy who shot at Eric. Motherfuckers hunting us. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. Do you copy? Over. Dropkick receiving. How's it going out there, Kolchak? Your friend sprung an IED on us. We're good. You want to keep your eyes open in case he's left any more love notes. Over. Copy that. <clears throat> moving up. Drop kick out. He's moving up. Shame you warned him about the tripwire. I don't think you guys are allowed to say that that much, you know? It was fine before. Chain of command and all that. Ah, oh, whatever. April 2nd, 1946. Whoa! October the 21st, 1946. Crow was the first to break into the tomb, an honor he shared with Bessie, that damned machine gun of his. It was a beast of a weapon, but it seemed to comfort the fellaheen doing the digging. This place has lain undisturbed for centuries. It is not the tomb of Alexander the Great, but a temple of an even older god king, the Akkadian despot, Naram Sin. Naram Sin. We have been mistaken. But Lady Bradshaw still declares it a find for the ages. A discovery that will write our names in the annals of history. It's pronounced annals. Looking out at this scepter hall, I have no reason to doubt her. <clears throat> so glad I don't have to read any of that. Oh, wait. <laughs> We've assembled our team. Top of my list was unintelligible, Crow. 
The bulldog of Omaha Beach. We found him in Cairo, brawling for money in a Levantine drinking club. Crow, well, see, the important part was on the back. Okay. This looks important. It's got constellations on it. A59. Star map. Ugh, get out of my fucking way, dude! Jesus, what is this camera angle? Hello? <laughs> I can't turn the camera! God, that is a horrendous! <sighs> Wanna see what I'm gonna do to this goat? Wait, 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 wait! Who? What did you. Who was stabbing who? Jason was stabbing. Eric? Or is that the Iraqi dude? I don't know. Oh, now I can move the camera. Oh, God. I was just bugged before. Alright. Let's clear this box and head on in. Okay. <laughs> he could be waiting for us down there. Shh. Listen. Whoever was getting only... stabbed. He's alive. Oh! No. It's not possible. You heard him just now. It can't be. That is definitely him. Because whoever I stabbed in that it's premonition was like a place, zombie. Jason. I'm telling you, I saw him die. All due respect, buddy. You're not your usual self. Can't know for sure. It's a trap. We don't know that. We don't leave men behind. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Sam Semper hey, Fi. Somebody want to tell me what's going on here? We heard Joey through the tunnel. We think we heard Joey. It was him, all right. Gonna rescue him. Let me remind you that I make the decisions. I'll lead the way. I'll take the lead. It's safer if you stay here. I'll take the lead. No, I'll take the lead. No, I'll take the lead. Because my balls are bigger than yours, son of a bitch. Oh, Joseph. Salim. Oh, no. لازم اقول له لا اتخانق لوحده مش اتخانق معاك لازم يكون في طريقه ثانيه من هنا لازم يكون في طريقه ثانيه اوه لوردي What was that Salim? Let's go look. Ah, oh, someone's wallet I'm rich. Until I give it back. To them. Is there anything I can get out of this? Oh, there you go. See, I don't like that. It's like you pick it up and then you're like looking around it and then it says back, but back progressed into the wallet. Just, just have like left click open or something like that. It's confusing. Oh, the camera's broke again. Nope, it's back to normal. One of them creatures is under this. Uh, 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 what the? Oh. Touch it. Poke it. Oh yeah, uncover that bad boy. Someone needs to clip their nails. I don't know about this, Salim. Maybe I probably should have just let sleeping dogs lie, you know? Whoa! Whoa!
They look cool. Uh. <clears throat> hey Eat some land, you son of a bitch. Resonate. You got this, Salim. Ah, he burns in sunlight. <laughs> Back to where we started. Uh, what do we do? What do we do? Hi! -ya! Eat steel! Here's a good look at it. <sighs> Got a weird face. Cool though. Hello, American. It's a bunch of dudes. <clears throat> They're gonna get annihilated by this bad creature. Salim took on one all on his own. That's cool. <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> Mimi, Lumpa, Crowbar are gonna head into the dart. I like this. I like the spooky caves! What that? It's got three little people on it. R19. There's a big one of champs. Oh, is this one A59? Bring it with you. Could be important. Man, the transitions between scenes are so odd. It's like they found a way of taking all the tension out of everything. <laughs> Where are we at now? 153 feet. We're making progress, lads. That one is a deep down, dark deep down. Check your corners. You still hear Joey? No, I just hear you. Wait, I thought Jason was leading. This is Mailman 21 Actual. Joey, do you hear me? How copy? Over. It'd be really cool if you could hear my voice on his radio down the end of the cave. Joey's. He's in bad shape. We gotta move fast. He don't got his you glasses. He'll be lost. Gomez, right? What actually happened to him? Um. Foreboding. There's a proving not foreboding. He died. Whatever's out there now, sure shit and Joey. Well, in battle, these things are often difficult to judge. What's that supposed to mean? He could have been mistaken, Sergeant. 
Hmm. I know what I saw. I know what I saw. Oh my God. <laughs> we just have to hope he's My alive. God! We've lost enough today. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, about Rachel. Is that so? Kolchak told me you people called her the queen bitch. Not by me. I knew her better than that. <laughs> I could take the shot easily, Jason. Rachel could be all Don't mine! Don't leave anything to chance. Bang, 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 bang! Ha, I'm just kidding. I'd never shoot you, Eric. Not in the back. How deep is that damn hole? Saw pictures like this back at the temple. Best guess is the quakes open them up. Let's just keep going. Bop, bop. Whoa. Is that blood? No, it's soup. Something really fucking nasty went down here. Okay. Joey! He's close. Doesn't even sound so like him. Up. Be quiet. We're walking into a trap. Ha! That's the Joey I know. Can I go in there? This fucking place. Oh no, not the birds. This is a perfect place for an ambush. Let's keep it slow and tight. No, double time. Joey needs us now. We gotta hurry. Joe, is that you? Take it slow. He's right. Advance with caution. Joseph? What? Oh, uh, uh, you shot first! Grenades don't explode like that in real life. This is the frag this grenades, they send bits everywhere. Come in, Lieutenant Over. They shred you instead of this exploding you. Three to two, one actual. Come in, Lieutenant Over. At least I think. Mailman 3 to drop kick. Colonel, are you there? Over. You're on your own, Nicholas. Oh, I like that music. Oh, but now you stopped it. Keep giving me the whoom. Reminds me of Annihilation. The music in that movie is nuts. Whoom. Whoom, whoom. Go forward. Jesus Christ, these controls. Uh, Dropkick, this is whis Whiskey Mailman. I don't know. This is the Milkman. Come in over. What? <gasps> Shh. Over there, there is a demon. <laughs> You're not wrong about that. Oh, I like that. They react sound like bats. They 
hear you. They hunt you. Seen their weakness, they burn in sunlight. Like any living being, they can be killed. Stake through the heart. Your bullets will only slow them down. Even a truck falling on them just makes them angry. You deduced a lot from killing together. one. Okay. <clears throat> That's like killing a man by chopping off his head you and then being like, kill it. you can only you decapitate them. Flanking position and get its attention. Even a kick in the I balls will just piss it off. Let's do, oh, after you, Superman. To you, Superman. Okay. Oh, his eyes are all like beady. That was cool. Also, I thought saying after you, Superman, would like put my faith in him, but it apparently messed up my relationship with him. Easy does it now. <clears throat> I can't hear that. We're being that sneaky and I didn't hear that we can be a lot louder oh no if the bat picks up the gun it's all over <laughs> I'm so good <laughs> Days of work. I've seen ugly in my life, but never that ugly. What the fuck are we up against? Those things are everywhere. Never before have I ever seen anything so vicious. <laughs> I've never seen anything. <laughs> Do you think those things are? You know what? I, I don't know. I didn't think to ask. How about you? Do you believe in demons? If you'd asked me that before, I'd have laughed in your face. But now, in the Sumerian myth, they say the souls of the dead went deep underground to the House of Ashes, where they lived on dust plagued by the demons of the underworld. I can't even begin to comprehend that. <laughs> like you, I also never believed. But look around you. Look where we are. Look what we have seen. Where did the bat go? We are trapped in the Sumerian temple. The name's Nick. Well, if we're in hell, I guess you should at least know my name. Nick K. Sergeant. Selim Osman, Lieutenant, Iraqi Army. <laughs> yeah, just put that in your back like Cloud Strife. Shukran This mailman 21 actual to mailman 3, <clears throat> I'll copy over. Solid copy, LT. I see your light, keep moving forward. 
I'm just ahead. Over. I'm coming to get you. Maybe let him know to not shoot your friend. Do anything, thumb. They won't hurt you. I said you gotta trust me. They won't hurt you. We're bros, Salim. Drop your weapon now! Stop pointing your guns at me! <laughs> that went right, off everyone, very quick. He's not hostile. I don't want to hurt you. Don't make a mistake you're gonna regret, soldier. Put your gun down now! No. You lower yours first. Drop your weapon or we will fire! Are you hearing me? Drop your weapon now! Huh? I didn't Was that a dude behind him? To die by a trigger. Happy American! Oh no. Okay! Enough! There's no point in fighting. Not anymore. Just show him the bad creature. I put one through your fucking skull. It won't change anything. I'd still be in this hell. Don't tempt me. <laughs> We're heading back to the temple. Tie him up. If he tries anything, put him down. Oh my god, just tell them what happened! After all we've been through? Thanks a lot. Oh my god. You were right. What, what is going is on? Makes your anus pucker, don't it? Hey, <laughs> you two boys do this together? Of course we did. <laughs> we fought it together and we won. Jason, oh. we need to talk about this guy. Not now. <laughs> this plane's a bust. Whatever the hell happened to Joey, he's gone. And there are fuck knows how many of those things out there. I say we pull back to the temple and regroup. I think that's the best plan I heard all day. This dialogue is fucking garbage, man. It's like, all you have to do is be like, no, he could have killed me, but we actually took out this thing together. He's fine, I trust him. No, time up. Okay, I guess we know friends now. Suit yourself. Why, why wouldn't you take water? Yeah. Ugh. I want you to tell me everything you know about these creatures. Have you seen them before? Do you know where they came from? How many are there down here? I hope you are a believer, brother. When those things come back, you're going to need higher power to pray to. What, you mean like Tom Cruise? My name is Lieutenant Colonel Eric King of the United States Air Force. I'm a chief nuclear engineer of the Iraq Survey Group, tasked with locating hidden chemical weapons. Our mission has uncovered something unexpected. Pop rocks in the caves. We'll now begin an autopsy of an unidentified life form. No, don't cut me. Oh. They're setting up for a run of phasmophobia. Why in the hole? Whoa! You were a little close to that. That's the last one. Should at least slow them down. Long enough to spot them on the cameras. Hurrah! We should reset that chirp wire. Give me a hand. 
We've been in some fucked up situations before. Oh, never as fucked as this. If I gotta fight these things, there's no one else I would want by my side. I've always got your back. We're gonna be best friends! You know I always got your back, buddy. Come with me. <clears throat> Did we just set up his bomb again? See, it was a great trap. Is that guy dead now? The Iraq captain? This is something else. I don't think so. You don't think? I well, know how many places like this we've bombed without a second thought. These relics are better off in the dust. <laughs> Fucking hell. What's your problem? These people didn't ask for this war. Most people in the countries never asked for the wars. They're far. <laughs> hey, uh, uh. Why are you defending the enemy, Sergeant? She doesn't nothing. You and me both know they're not all our enemies. Fuck, Jason. Yeah. It's about the girl at the checkpoint. Shit, Nick. How many times? We thought she had a bomb. It was just a bag of groceries. We fucked up. Say nothing. Because I don't want Jason spouting any more of his Anything bullshit. Else you want to add, Sergeant? Yeah, that's what I thought. Mailman 2 1 actual, this is dropkick. Request update, over. 2 1 actual, receiving. Cameras are green and the holes have been demolished, over. Good work, Lieutenant. Treat through the eastern corridor and be on your guard, over. I hear you, over now. Approximation, the creature is eight feet tall, bipedal, winged. Wing webbing appears to be affixed to its forelimbs and to the digits of its hands. Epidermis looks to be smothered in some sort of excretion. Underneath it is... You saying he's covered in shit? <laughs> ...diseased, almost. The creature is starting to rapidly decompose in death. Dropkick, this is Mailman T1 Actual, approaching Eastern Passage. Over. I see you. Christ, <clears throat> these doors took a hammer in. Those things must have come through here in force. Whoever manned that weapon took a stand and held them off. Before they got massacred from behind. These creatures aren't dumb. They're predators. Bet your bottom dollar if they came this way before, they could come again. forever to actually do anything. There's a lot of just like wandering around in hallways in this game. I mean, I guess, but you know what I mean? Feels like it takes forever for anything to happen. What's down there? Bones? It's the closest I've been to hell. <laughs> I don't know about that, Nick. You ever been to Florida? Why would you do that? Why would you spit into that hole? <laughs> hey, Bonesy! What's going on? Hey, Nick, he's got your bucket hat! Oh. <laughs> Fuck, she do to deserve that. Kill by a stake through the heart. Wait. <laughs> Pretty sure those creatures didn't do this. Who did? I don't know. Buffy? Hell yeah. Who? Vampire Slayer. Maybe you should hold on to that. Wait, were they... 
remember knowing there wasn't one of the bat creatures, was it? And now they just transformed back into a person. Is that what Eric's gonna find out? It says he's rapidly decomposing, but what if it's just reverting? That'd be kind of cool. Where? Here. Stank of death and was littered with bleh, enough to be covered in flies. Crow things bleh, down here after robbing them. I pity those hapless wanderers, the fear they must have felt. Bleh. This was not what he wanted to show us. An unearthly bleh, when Mary asked what it was, Bradshaw nodded to Crow, who broke open the dynamite. She said she intended to find out. Oh wait, maybe there's something on the back. What's that? It says they found something weird down here. Yeah, no shit. Oh yeah. Blowing a hole through the rock face, we found a gateway to a strange world below. A phosphorescence emanated from beneath, casting its eldritch light over us all. Lady Bradshaw was insistent that we descend further. Perhaps Mary is right, and Bradshaw is becoming reckless and uncontrollable. But I can't stop thinking about what's down there. I am now working with Crow and Pullman to set up a winch and elevator to descend into the shaft. What mysteries lie below, I wonder, undisturbed by the world above. Ooh. Honestly, their expedition sounds more interesting than the one I'm doing. At least he has a, a well, I was gonna say he has a, a nice accent, but Jason also has an accent that I like making fun of, so. It's not so much the accent as, as what he's saying with that accent. It's such like stereotypical crap. crap. What'd you find? Crap, he's a crap the same Nothing time I do. gonna get us out of here. Uh, it's a cylinder seal, a cylinder seal depicting an ancient city, Nick. God, get it together, right, well, Nick! I couldn't give a crap if it was the crown jewels of England. Okay. Do you think Jason's gonna die? Oh. Oh, wait, no, go back. Perfect. This looks like a good choke point. Any of those freaks coming up from below are sure to pass through here. Set some charges? Yeah. Yeah, rig these pillars for maximum coverage. More likely to see the trip wires, though. You think those things can tell a difference? We shouldn't underestimate them. We mine the sides. We're more likely to catch them out. Smaller spread, but the explosives are better hidden. What do you think? Plan them on the sides. Those things are devious fuckers. You're right. We plant the charges to the side of the hall. All right. They won't see this one coming. I can hear your brain taking away. What is it? Should have given her a second warning. Fuck, man, I wish I hadn't asked. I'm through talking about this. <laughs> God. Yeah. What's left to say? <laughs> Jesus, Jesus. You know that checkpoint was a prime target for suicide bombers. We had to act in the moment. We had to make a call. It was the wrong call. Why is it that no one ever tells it straight? Everyone just makes up bullshit to get by. That's why we're in the sandbox in the first place, right? I just want the truth, Jason. Shooting that woman messed with my head. You seriously gonna tell me it didn't mess with yours, man? Uh, I need to humble Jason out a little bit. We fucked up. If we make it out of here, we'll face up to that. If we die down here, maybe it's what we deserve. You know I was seeing Rachel. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, I Take guess. Three weeks. I guess not. Three weeks. That was way longer than that. It's armed. 
Okay, we'll just gloss over that infidelity talk. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. We're at a stairwell leading down into a maze. Please advise, over. Acknowledged. Pull back now and secure the perimeter. Dropkick out. Mount a camera here, and let's head back. Alrighty. Hey, I knew Ashley Tisdale wouldn't go out that easily. She has to have her apocalypse now moment where you come up from the blood and you have a flame in your hand. Yep. <laughs> 394 feet! I think I saw you had it bad. About done yourself this time, puppy dog. <laughs> Jesus Christ. The dialogue did not match the scene at all. Nick? Jason? Oh shit. <laughs> See, it's exactly apoc is it apocalypse now that has that scene? And then they replicate it in the newer Tomb Raider games. Oh, I can't shit. do anything good. What do you think? Fucking Pazuzu's over here, covered in fire. It looks cool though. It's the coolest looking part of the game so far. What this? Is that an ancient helmet? An <laughs> ancient helmet! <laughs> it is! <laughs> Just a nondescript ancient helmet. Doesn't matter what period, what nation. It's just ancient, okay? What's happening? Oh lordy. What the hell? Nah, it's just bats. Bastards are everywhere. Bruce Wayne hates them as well. <laughs> I thought she was knocking herself in the head to be like, come on, Ashley Tisdale. Ah, oh, we can do this! <laughs> You're not gonna light that on fire with a piece of sleeve, are you? Oh, come on! That's not how they work! <laughs> My god! You're being chased. I mean, as cliche as it is, this does look pretty cool. Spooky. I wish there was more of this. Than like silly military dudes walking around saying a whole bunch of nothing. This is spooky. What the hell is that light? Uh, it's the thing that you just lit. <laughs> oh no, Ashley Tisdale, we're gonna need a shower after this one. It's got two big vampire teeth just in the front. That's kind of cool. Saliva. 
We have collected and bottled the black saliva present on the maw of the creature extracted from the cocoon. I and others who smelt the substance have experienced heart palpitations and a heightened sense of fear. Such have reported odd, vi- or some have reported odd visual effects, such as a change to colors. You better not turn around and tell me that they secrete a vapor that makes you imagine them as bat creatures. I swear to fucking God. Just commit to the bat creatures. We have attempted to secure additional samples of the saliva from the site where M was attacked. Hmm, mommy. The smell was so overpowering that respirators were used to collect the samples. We recommend the use of masks at all, at all times and handling samples to avoid becoming affected. Sensation similar to experience with mushrooms. Don't you dare do it. Don't you dare do what you did with Madame Madame, who was like, oh, it's all the vapor that's actually making you see shit. I hate that. If you do that, if that's the end of this game, I'm not playing any more of them. I'm done. If they mess up the ending to this game, I'm done. I'm not playing another one. I'm jumping the gun here a bit, but they're starting to give me a lot of warning signs. <laughs> Uh, that's right behind you. Could you fucking go faster, Ashley Tisdale? Okay? Yeah. A little bit quicker. I don't think I would revel in being in the Blood River as long as you are. A little faster there. Is that what all that green stuff then? She was like, what's that light behind that big wheel? Is all that green just... gases? Bitch, you better not. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> How did that get set on fire? in this universe! Maurice! Run. <laughs> I forgot she even existed in this game. Creature has powerful claws and fangs formed from hardened and identifiable tissue. Two of the incisors appear grossly malformed and discolored, oddly out of place. The membrane surrounding the specimen seems to originate from its mouth. Blood is like nothing I've seen. I'll now perform a UV sweep to further inspect the fluids. Ah, uh, he gonna burn. Hey, some advice? You had your chance to talk. <laughs> yes, but the demon does not react <coughs> well to sunlight. I would be very careful with that light. I said be quiet. Oh, boy. <laughs> Don't move. I, I told Eric. Double check. Is that you? Er, Eric. I'm a Joey. You're Eric. Uh. Oh, that's zombie Joey, all right. <laughs> he gone. Damn you. Ah, dang it. Are oh, you, Shit. you, you heckin' fricker. Ah, fiddle. 
Eric, you can't do anything right in this game, can you? Uh oh. Looks like a line out. Maybe we can get the radio working and send a signal out. It's worth a shot. A long shot. No, we don't even know if there's a working transmitter on the surface. Those wires gotta go somewhere, though. Like, you think they still work? What if Joey's What's turning into like a zombie up? thing, and then whatever this person is? Well, don't feel much. Is that Joey? Out there. Oh boy! Joseph, calm down! Fuck, Joey! Yeah, he does. They just turn into them. Shit, Joey, it's me! It's from all the, it's from all the gases! You got that through his vest? Oh my god. <laughs> nice! Bye, Joey. Damn. Joey got fried for a second time. God almighty. So they... <sighs> Maybe when they die, they get that gas stuff, or whatever you were saying it was, um, and it tra transforms them into that. Similar to mushrooms, eh? That's not similar to mushrooms. I, I swear to God, if they mess up this ending, I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> right now, I'm just kind of like barely hanging on. I'm kind of like finishing it for the sake of finishing it, because right now... It's like little moments that are like, oh, cool, like the creatures are cool, but if I have to listen to these characters any longer, I'm gonna go crazy. They're, they're the worst! <laughs> I, I always try and have fun with what I'm playing. I always try and get through it and just kind of like dick around with it, and that's what I'm kind of do, trying to do with this. But man, some of the dialogue is just... It's just not good at all. This is such a step down from their other games, but... We'll keep playing it and we'll get through it. I Again, I know people don't like hearing that and they're, they're just like, oh, Sean, shut up and play the game. But I, if I'm not having that much fun with it, it's going to be so obvious. So I'm just going to be transparent with you and say that this is fairly boring. <laughs> but hopefully, I don't think we have that much longer to go into it. This is, what, like three, four hours in? I can't remember. How much of this have I played? I don't know, but we, we're probably not that far off from the end. These games usually aren't that long, and they're... I mean, Man of Medan was a little wonky as well, and I hated the ending. Little Hope was great all the way up until the ending. So they're kind of two for two on that now, and this is showing some very unfavorable signs. So we'll see what happens. We'll keep an open mind a little bit further. But I'm telling you, if they mess up this ending, I'm done with the Dark Pictures Anthology. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. it. Hopefully, it might be at least fun to watch uh, more than it is to actually play, because I'm not really doing a whole lot. I, like, make a couple of decisions here and there, but it doesn't really feel like they do anything yet. It's kind of like my relationship with the characters change, but I don't... It hasn't, like, really led to massive implications yet. Like, I know I, I shot a couple of people, <laughs> but that doesn't really seem to have had a knock-on effect yet. Throwing the spear at the person right at the start when I was back in ancient times doesn't seem to have had an effect yet. Or maybe it doesn't, I just haven't noticed it yet, but we'll see what happens. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching! I'll see you in the next one! Bye!